From the beginning, I always knew that if I want to do my journalistic work, there is always chance to get arrested, to be in prison. Anybody actually actually taking this kind of job in Iran kind of understand the risk. After the Iranian government shut down many of the newspapers and magazines there, reporters turned to the internet, blogging to expose oppression in their nation. Ruzba Mir Brahimi is one of them. He was arrested in 2004 and held for two months, handcuffed and blindfolded. There was a case in Iran, and the case was actually Zahra Kazemi that I was trying to cover. That was the main reason that I got arrested. Broken bones, bruises, and other traumas. A litany of injuries suffered by Zara Kazemi. Kazemi, an Iranian-born photographer, was arrested and accused of spying after taking pictures of a Tehran prison in June 2003. Eleven days later, she was dead. The Iranian government today finally admitted they beat an international journalist to death. She was in Tehran covering protests by students demanding reforms. During this period, the intelligence service and the judiciary became very sensitive about this issue and my work. What did they accuse you of doing? For example, um, uh, acting against national security. This is the same for everybody in Iran. And uh, other things, uh, publication of um, falsehoods. They were actually digging to my life to find out what kind of the thing they can find out and to create a, a prison time for me. Is it worse? Is it not worse? I, is it worse to stay at prison for 15 years and you know you are spending a lot of time in a solitary confinement which itself is actually torture. These new things happening in the last a few months in the U.S. reminded me exactly the same. The new administration and new president approach to the media or to independency of the media is almost the same because anything he doesn't like, he said, you know, it's fake. Mr. President-elect, can you give us a question? You're rude. attacking us. Can you give us a question? You are fake news. Fighting with media, I guess the very, very negative and dangerous signal. That's the beginning of dictatorship. They are the enemy of the people. Am I worried being journalist in the US? Mm, I, I experienced much more worse situation than my experience maybe could help somebody.